Let's meet our next two inductees. They made Bondi Beach come to life on that golden day in the year 2000. Kerry Pothast and Natalie Cook can be credited with raising beach volleyball to an elite sport in the eyes of the Australian public. Aussies had few expectations when beach volleyball made its Olympic debut in 1996 and the duo of Cook and Pothast were teamed together for the first time. They not only came home from Atlanta with a bronze medal, they set Bondi alight four years later when they beat the Brazilians, Bede and Baha in straight sets in the Olympic final. What a moment for Australian sport and for beach volleyball. After the Sydney Olympics, they were awarded the Medal of Australia. Potthouse and Cook clinched 92 FIVB victories together. And when Kerry retired, Natalie teamed with other partners to take her tally of five FIVB victories to 155. Natalie represented Australia at five successive Olympic Games, finishing fourth in 2004 and fifth in 2008. She was inducted into the International Volleyball Hall of Fame in 2013 and continues to coach and mentor juniors. Kerry carries on her great contribution as president of the Australian Beach Volleyball Commission. Two great Olympians and trailblazers for their sport. Tonight we induct Natalie Cook and Kerry Pothast into the Sport Australia Hall of Fame. when you get a presentation from Kathy Freeman and she says awesome to you. <laughs> That's when you know you're done okay. Uh, Kerry, you're up first. Uh, tell me, Sydney 2000, the sun was shining, the crowds were roaring. That was my memory. How was it for you? Tell us what exactly you remember of that moment. Uh, it wasn't too far away from how I'm feeling right now. My heart is pounding. You're being... wearing more. <laughs> yeah. I'm a little bit more clothed. Yes, thank you, Steph, for pointing that out. Uh, I'm standing next to one of the most amazing, incredible athletes in Australia as well. Uh, very proud to be here. Very proud to be on the sands of Bondi Beach and representing our sport at the Olympic Games. And uh, there were so many people, so many of our family and our friends that were there. But I tell you what, all I could see was the sand in front of me. I was completely focused, but when that last ball landed out, um, it just all came into to focus. I looked up, I saw my family, I saw my friends, I saw our coaches, our support team, and then I saw Natalie just charging for me. <laughs> and she bowled me over and it took me a while to get out of the sand, but it was a pretty incredible moment. Yeah, it sure was. 1996, you guys came together and, and really put beach volleyball on the radar for gold. Uh, Nat, tell us, what made it work with you guys? Because you, you've been a traitor since. You've gone on to other, other volleyball partners, but uh, that was a very special team that you had. What, what made it special? Yeah, it, it was very special. I think we took it for granted at the time. Um, thinking that you know every volleyball player you could team with you could do really well but we did have something very unique it was our chemistry it was it was our desire to win it was Kara's muscles um, and uh, she was the fastest server in the world so you know I was glad she was on my team but it was our willingness to just do whatever it took and we just wanted to win so badly um, but we had a fantastic team around us and I just want to acknowledge our coaches that are here tonight, our success coach, Keurig, and Howie, our chiropractor, and, and um, we've got Doug and Marcia, the people that just were with us all the time. So that was what was really special. They kept us together because we fought a lot. <laughs> yes, we did. Yes, we did. Yes, we did. Yeah, sure. You got on great, guys. Well, Kerry, you're now calling all the shots. You're president of the Australian Beach Volleyball Commission as well as coaching. Uh, do you prefer being in charge? <laughs> Nat would have... Uh, I don't know if Nat wants to ask that question. Um, I, uh, I love working with the Volleyball Federation now. Um, 
I, I see it as a very important role, uh, it, and even being inducted tonight, it's a really important role for us as role models within the community, and um, I think it's really important when we do achieve something that we can give back and, and continue to inspire not only our athletes, but athletes of all sorts of sports, and I think tonight is, we've, we've won so many awards and we've had a lot of accolades over the years, but I think tonight is really for our sport, for volleyball, it's the first time we've had a volleyball athlete in the Hall of Fame and, and we hope that there are many more to come, so for me tonight is about our sport. Well Nat, so... Well, Nat, your longevity was remarkable. First female athlete to compete in five Summer Olympics in succession. Did you think about going for six in Rio? You had a bronzer on the world champs. You, did it cross well, your mind? Would anyone like to go to Rio? <laughs> yeah. Um, you know, it's, it's one of the birthplaces of our sport. And obviously, when you see beach volleyball in Copacabana Beach, it's very special. So I thought about it for probably that long. Uh, 20 years of Olympic competition is very challenging on the body, the mind, and the spirit. And, but after hearing Michael's, all of the things Michael does, I feel lazy. So um, uh, my hat's off to him. Uh, but Rio will be amazing. And, it, and it will, you will see beach volleyball as the centerpiece of the Olympic Games in, in Brazil. And Kerry will be there commentating, because she is amazing at that. Um, Channel 7 need to know that. And. Uh, <laughs> And uh, hopefully, you know, I'll be there watching the next generation from Australia. But as Kerry said, she now does a lot with the sport. I'm putting beach volleyball into all of the surf clubs around the country to help the grassroots for our sport. And hopefully we'll see a young nipper become an Olympian in the near future. Ladies, you've gone in different directions. It's wonderful to have you up here once more as a team on stage. Congratulations on your induction into the Australia Sport Hall of Fame. Nat Cook and Kerry Pothas.